it's Karen here. Welcome, it's day 15 in our 24 days of tags for 2023. And here we've got something on black cardstock. So I asked you all if there was any technique or anything that you wanted to see and someone said they'd like to see stamping on black card. So here I have a choice of two. So the theme today, stamping on black card. I have embossed this because I feel that that is the easiest way to get a really bold, bright, stark image on black card. So I've used gold embossing powder and white, and you know that my favourite will be WOW embossing powder. For the gold, I've used metallic gold rich powder, and for white, it's opaque bright white. The gorgeous stamp that I'm using here is from Chocolate Brock and it's called Checkered Flowers. It's lovely. So what you want, if you're just going to do this, you want a very bold, big stamp. And then what I've done around the edge is I've, quotes stitched it. I haven't really, but I've done this dash 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 stitching with a white Sigma ball roller pen and here I've put some gold paint around the edge and I will show you how I do that with a really straightforward paintbrush. So this is going to be super quick because you've seen me emboss a thousand times um, and I'm probably going to speed it up so that it's just easier for you. Just to note that I always use my little chalk pad. Make sure that I keep my fingers away from the card. With my chalk pad, I just turn it over and give it a flick to make sure that everything comes off. And then your embossing pad, the embossing ink sticks really well. Okay, we will get started. So I've got my stamp in my stamp press with my black card ready and I'm just going to ink it up. So there we have our lovely two tags embossed, one in gold and one in white. And I'm going to show you just how I finished them off. So I am using this white Sigma Ball roller pen. And to do that, I'm just going to hold the pen upright. Um, people often say, how do you get it to roll? And that is what I do. You can't move too quickly, you just hold it upright and then gently just stitch around the edge of the tag. There we have it. Now, you can actually very effectively colour with coloured pencils on black card. I'll show you an example of how I did that at the end. So there we have it. 
and then I just put a white piece of cotton as the thread. So how effective and simple is that? Other paints and inks that you can use, acrylic paint, so those Posca pens, that will work really well. And you can see if you want to doodle or something, use this um, for creating uh, colour on your black tags. Now, for the surrounding on our gold embossed, I'm going to take some paint, tiny bit of paint. Now, the loveliest gold paint I found is this one. I'm just going to put the lid on before I show you the top. This is called, um, it's Dragon's Eye. Yes, Dragon's Eye by Finnebear. It's a lovely, crystally, sparkly gold paint. And there's one in silver as well. So I'm just going to put a tiny bit onto my mat. Tiny bit of water so that it runs. And then I'm going to take one of these paintbrushes. Cheap as chips, these paintbrushes. And the nice thing is that they've got this sort of frayed edge here. So you're just going to dab it. So you can see how I'm just smushing it there. And because of these frayed edges of the paintbrush, it just gives you that lovely organic. So where I had a bit of a, a bit of a mishap on the side of the tag here, it doesn't matter because look. So there's another way that you can edge your tags. As I say, just creating this lovely organic little look. And there you go. So that's the gold one. And again, what I did was as I just tied it with some gold cord. So that's the tag. But I also wanted to show you what effect you can get by colouring on dark coloured card with coloured pencils. That is just using my Signable roller pen to go around the edge of a stencil and then colour with coloured pencils. So those are two options. So today it's black tags for you. I would love to see your makes. Thanks so much for watching. Bye for now.